Number one is a Ford. Uh, I'm sure that all of you know, but a Ford is just to be able to uh, uh, have enough resources or money to pay for something, right? <clears throat> Number two, momentum. Uh, momentum refers to uh, the power of something to move forward and keep going. Uh, so you can build momentum, you know, uh, as you, let's say if you are uh, jogging and then suddenly the trail goes kind of downhill, you're building momentum, you're just building more power as you go down because of the, the gravity, the force of the gravity is making you go faster. Uh, number three, keep the ball rolling is uh, an expression for just to keep things going and keep things progressing. <clears throat> Number four, set something apart, uh, is to be able to uh, differentiate something. So uh, maybe uh, if you are trying to organize, you have to set some things apart. Uh, number five, thought out. Thought out is an expression, or it's an adjective, but we also say like if something is well thought out or 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 uh, poorly thought out, and what it refers to is uh, how much effort uh, and thought that someone had put into producing something. So if someone gave you a well thought out gift, that means that they know exactly what you like and when to give it to you. It's not a, it's not just about like a, a special day or holiday. But like if you had a rough day and then they show up and they have like chocolates for you. That, that's a really well thought out gift. I think it's. <laughs> uh, anyways, number six, ever changing. Uh, ever changing is, uh, is a way to say that uh, something is continuously uh, changing and evolving. And that's our, our uh, vocabulary for today.